Hi everyone and welcome to my YouTube channel. I am Alisa, Certified Personal Development Counselor and Relationship Coach and in this video I will share with you three main reasons why women reject you and what you can do about it. Some of you may perceive rejection as triggering and some of you may perceive rejection as provocative, as an invitation to pursue your favorite woman relentlessly. But whichever the case, let's discover together what causes women to reject you. Number one, on an energetic level, the lack of polarity between your leading energies. Number two, on a mental emotional level, your attachment styles. Number three, on a physical level, the lack of physical attraction. Although I am sure that the online and social media platforms are saturated by notions like polarity, energies, masculine, feminine, and you may have had enough of it. Physics do answer a huge part of our question, so bear with me as I get a little bit more in depth with my explanation so you can find solutions to the problems you face. The first reason why women reject you is the lack of polarity between your leading energies. The opposite of rejection is attraction. So in order to understand why women reject you, it is necessary to look at the law of polarity. The law of polarity states that everything in the universe has an opposite. Everything is dual, negative and positive, hot and cold, masculine and feminine, and opposites attract each other. To quote Sir Isaac Newton's third law of motion, for every action, there is an equal and opposite reaction. In practice, this means that in order to steer up a sexual connection, the two partners must complement each other. If your woman's leading energy is feminine, then your leading energy as a man should be masculine in order for chemistry to spark between you. Masculine energy is all about doing, thinking, planning, protecting, giving, making decisions, getting things done, while feminine energy complements it by focusing on being, allowing, receiving, nurturing, surrendering, experiencing, expressing, feeling. It's like a dance between an active and a passive type of energy. However, something really important for you to understand is that it doesn't actually matter who is at the helm of the masculine energy and who is leading with feminine energy, as long as those are your authentic leading energies. This being said, you shall not beat yourself up as a man if your leading energy is feminine and you are the one bringing in the feeling, the nurturing and the poetry in the relationship. As long as you don't aim to marry a woman who is feeling at her best when she's doing the same thing, the sparks won't be late to appear. The second reason why women reject you may have to do with your attachment styles. To explain this concept in simple terms, I will say this. The way we attach to other adults in our lives now is highly influenced by the relationship that we have developed with our main caregiver in our first years of life. There are four types of attachment styles that were initially identified by psychoanalyst John Balby that illustrate the theory of how humans connect with one another. Secure attachment, anxious attachment, dismissive avoidant attachment, and fearful avoidant attachment. While attachment styles are not scientifically proven to predict a couple's compatibility, they are definitely revealing of our patterns in relationships how we communicate, what we expect from a partner, who we tend to feel more comfortable with, and whom complements us and our shadows the most. For example, 
Partners with secure attachment can trust others easily, are attuned with their emotions, can communicate what bothers them directly, and can be flexible in a relationship. On the other hand, the anxious type has a hypersensitive nervous system, struggles to communicate their needs directly, and can easily act out when being triggered, while an avoidant person will pull back as soon as they perceive their partner as being needy. Bottom line, some women will pull back because of their resistance to your attachment style. So be mindful, but not hopeless. Because despite of how we are initially hardwired, attachment styles can change throughout time through self-awareness and being in the presence of a securely attached partner. The third reason why women reject you might be the lack of physical attraction. As simple as this. We often hear the words, don't judge a book by its cover, but unfortunately, we all do it. And without an ounce of superficiality, I will say this, when it comes to choosing your partner, you are free to judge a book by its cover. You are the one who will wake up next to that person, maybe for the rest of your life, and you are free to choose whom you want to see when the sun comes up, or less poetically said, who you want to bang. I once asked my grandma what I should look for in a partner, especially within a marriage, and I will never forget his brilliant piece of advice. Choose someone compassionate and attractive to you. And since my grandparents had a marriage of over 50 years, obviously his words stuck with me. And in the beginning I thought like, mm, isn't it a little bit superficial? Well, apparently it's not. Honestly, I was expecting a huge chunk of advice, but his was so simple. Find someone compassionate and attractive. Attractive to you. So do not take it personally when a woman rejects you based on the lack of physical attraction. Thank her for her honesty and move on gracefully. Sure, personality can always outshine the looks, but let's try to be respectful of someone's taste rather than intrusive. My loves, these are the three main reasons why women reject you, but I couldn't end up this video without mentioning a few more real life examples that I know that you expect me to call out in this video. Being disrespectful, lacking self-control, lacking self-confidence, lacking boundaries, lacking self-hygiene, lacking initiative, lacking generosity, lacking empathy, lacking curiosity, lacking patience, lacking financial security, obsessing over sex, obsessing over yourself, being passive-aggressive, being manipulative, being a cheater being a bully or being boring. Now that we brought all of this to the table, make sure to comment below with the one surprising reason why you've been rejected by a woman so we can laugh together and learn together. I'm Alisa and if you like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my YouTube channel and hit the notifications button to never miss a YouTube date with me. If you have any other questions or want more guidance from me on how to become the best man, lover and partner you can, click the link in the description of this video and sign up to start working with me now. Until next time, stay shameless.